Alright, what's up YouTube? I I'm running again to work today. I'm just leaving Chinatown in like Soho-ish. And today I got a notice from my insurance company that my primary care provider was out of network, which has got me super angry because they're not. Anyways, they're trying to charge money, blah 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 blah. And I left that call and was left to work. And as soon as I left the house, I was very aware of the muscles behind my heart, rhomboids, uh, part of the trapezius, etc. And I was really aware of that place. I was also really aware of my tibia yesterday, my shin bones, because after I ran with the weight vest, I like took a few days because it was like really hard. <laughs> and yesterday I ran a little bit and I sat feeling the essentially the compressive forces in the tibia last night and just like kind of watching the sensations as they changed and did different things. So I'm very aware of the sort of spongy factor or the spongy percussive factor <laughs> in my tibia. Let me get past this guy. So what I've been doing is feeling my tibia, my shin bones, and also feeling the back of my heart, the whole area of my heart. And essentially imagining that I'm allowing heart energy or heart chi sensation from the heart to flow down into my legs. And I'm making the legs throughout this run more and more passive. So specifically my lower legs, I'm just saying, okay, what's the least I can do and keep running? Because really that's a question of efficiency. That's a question I'm asking my body, which muscles do you actually need to use to perform this action and which are sort of emotionally based and probably aren't working that well. So I ran and ran with this sort of back of the heart feeling and shin bone feeling and then switched to uh, thinking about my neck and how it tends to come forward and also use that sort of heart radiating heart image to help relax my neck up. We mentioned that when I saw the chiropractor, he did a little click click and instantly my neck was there. But once I realized what that sort of meant in terms of the socio-emotional spheres, I dropped my head back down. So anyways, I'm working on these things going into work. And I got like a lot of new visions for uh, the structure of the business.